So 11 Labs just introduced a new and exciting AI tool called Voice Remixing. Basically, you can use this AI tool to change a voice or any voice in your account, including a clone voice, into something that sounds very different. It could be a different gender, different accent, different speaking style, or even different audio quality. So in this video, I'm going to show you on how you can use this new AI tool from Elon Labs. But first, let me show you one example of an audio or voice that has been remixed using this AI tool. So this is the original and this is the one with a different accent. So let me play the audio first. This is the voice we'll be remixing in today's demo. A poised and sophisticated English spy in her late 30s. Okay, so that was the British accent. Let's try this one with San Francisco accent. San Francisco's bright lights make people careless. They never notice the shadows listening in. Okay, it is still more or less the same person or the same character, but the accent is very different. So anyway, let's get into the tutorial on how to use voice remixing. First, let's go to 11labs.io and you can log into your account. And to access voice remixing, you have to navigate to menu called voices, or you can also just click this plus button or click this button that says create or clone a voice and select voice remixing. This tool is still in alpha, but from what I can tell, it is very much usable, although not quite consistent. Now, to modify or to remix a voice, you can click this button and I'm going to select my own voice. So this is the clone that I created in 11 Labs. Take a listen. Laughter is the sunshine that brightens even the simplest day. Okay, so that's that's my voice according to the 11 Labs clone. Now, here you can describe what is the thing that you want to change on this voice. Again, you can change it with a different gender, accent, etc. And if you want to get some inspiration about the things that are possible, you can click this button that says inspiration and select the category. Let's say I want to change the accent. And uh, there are some options like uh, Australian accent, French accent, but I want to change it to a British accent. There you go. So that's going to be the instruction. And of course, feel free to modify the instruction as you like. And after that, you can click this button to select the strength of the prompt. So this is known as the temperature control, but I do like that now they are using this format instead of just selecting the number between zero to one. This is a lot easier to understand. So there are settings like low, medium, high, and max. It's up to you which one that you want to use. I think for most voices, it's gonna be medium, but some voices needs to be using a high or even max setting. And honestly, there is no one setting that will fit all. So you have to play around with these settings and see which one uh, is the best for your voice. Now, in this case, I'll select medium because I think that's going to be, uh, generally speaking, acceptable for most voices. And after that, if you want to use a, uh, a script, then you can click this button and provide the script that you want to use for this voice. This is optional, by the way, but if you want to use it, uh, this is actually using the 11 version 3 model, and, and that means it can use feature called audio tag, so you can make the voice to be whispering or uh, screaming or a feeling sad or anything it's up to you so that's just some examples that you can try with this version 3 model but i'm not going to use it so i'm going to just use empty script and let ai decide the appropriate script for this project now after that you can click this button and wait for voice remixing to create at least three different variations of this voice and later i'm going to compare it with the original voice so i'll just skip forward and show you the final result all right, so it took less than 30 seconds to generate these different voices. So let's play every single one of them. And again, I'm going to play the original voice first so we can compare it better with the other version. So I'm going to play this. Laughter is the sunshine that brightens even the simplest day. Okay, that was the original voice. And let's try this one. Right then, fancy a cuppa? <laughs> I was just thinking, it's a rather splendid day. It is decent. Let's try this one. Right then. Fancy a cuppa? <laughs> I was just thinking, it's a rather splendid day for a stroll, wouldn't you? Yeah, that sounds a bit more serious. Right, right then. Fancy a cuppa? <laughs> I was just thinking, it's a rather splendid day for a stroll, wouldn't you agree? 
Okay, I honestly like the first iteration. This one is uh, actually a lot better than the other two. But in case you are not quite happy with these voices, you can click generate more and select different settings. So after that, you can click generate again and it, it will create another three variations. Now, in this case, I'm not going to do that. So I'll just uh, show you the other things that you can do after that. So here, uh, you can actually iterate the voice again let's say you want to change the pitch or the emotion or the pacing then you can click this button and that will send the voice as a reference and then you can describe the thing that you want to change so you can do an iterative work until you get the voice that you want so that's why this voice remixing feature is quite exciting and in case you want to use it you want to use the voice for your next project then you can click this button save voice and you can provide a name some label description and click save voice and later you can use that voice the remix voice on tools like text to speech so you can create you know different uh, audio based on the voice that has been remixed using voice remixing so overall that's basically everything that you need to know about the voice remixing feature from 11 labs it is not difficult it is quite easy and i think uh, they're going to add even more features and capabilities in the future but anyway that's all from me thank you so much for watching and i'll see you on my next video i wish you a great day ahead